Hello our beautiful people, welcome back to our channel. If this is your first time of watching us, thank you for stopping by. And if you are an old subscriber, thank you for coming back. And if you are new to this channel, my name is Jennifer and And I'm Moa. Today's topic we're gonna to be talking about the pros and cons of interracial dating. First, are we gonna talk about the cons first? Or I think to... uh, we'll talk about pros. Okay, yeah. So uh, this information I'm about to share with you guys was collected from a group of people, about five or six of my friends living here in Ireland. So they gave us their, they gave me their own uh, side of the story about interracial dating. Nice. So um, the first I am going to go with is I have them all written down because they were not only from me; they were from a group of other people. Yeah. So the first one is. You, you can learn about another culture. So the girl that brought this was like, um, when she uh, was into, when she started this interracial dating, she could learn more cultures from her partner because he was teaching her a lot of things. And uh, he also said well, he learned. You, yeah, you, I think you teach other, each other different things, you know? Oh, yeah. Because they see like life is short, and plus two, not everybody knows everything. Mm -hmm. So you learn different things from different cultures. You know? Exactly. That's a good part of it. Yeah. Then uh, another thing uh, someone said to me is you will, es you, you will expose yourself to a new way of thinking. That's true. Both ways. Yeah, that um, you will um, you start thinking differently because uh, you are kind of like uh, adding someone's idea to your own idea. That's right, yeah. Yeah, then the third one is incorporating aspects of cultural race religion into your daily life and the, um, the other one we have here is having an incredible experience with someone you love and you respect yeah so this one is like um, an experience with someone that you love and you uh, I don't know what she's talking about here mm -hmm. so but anyway she said she had an incredible experience with someone that she loves and she respects cool. then uh, this other one is possibly learning a new language yeah, you learned the slang anyway. Yeah, uh, for me, I think I learned a lot of uh, yeah, the Irish. Pigeon English. Yo, you learned the Pigeon English, right? Well, you know, you, know, you catch on when you're hearing it, you know. You want to speak no, one no, no, Pigeon English? What I mean is that you know. <laughs> yeah, no, you speak no, one. Rare, you speak it. No, always say to your, our you audience. It, you speak it. Say to our audience. I don't know what to say. Any of the Pigeon English. Know, I don't know, I don't know. But you say you understand the Pigeon no, English yeah, now? Yeah, I hear it, yeah. Okay, so I will say something in the Pigeon language yeah. and you will translate it. Okay. Oh, mom, I'm at the hungry. I'm hungry. I don't even know what I will chop today. I don't know what I need today. And uh, tomorrow, I the thing will busy die because a uh, person got already. I will go work tomorrow. Yeah, because it's busy tomorrow because you're working. Okay, so you see, Owen is learning the pigeon, the Nigeria pigeon English. Yeah, you have to speak out a few words, you know. I know. Then, the one I actually added on my own is like me i'm going to use myself as an example i'm telling you guys that interracial relationship or dating is like any other relationship that has challenges but yeah. it's worth it that was the only one i added to it the other ones were collected from was a collective effort from oh, other yeah. other girls yeah so now we'll go to the con yeah the cons guys the cons. One, people within your social cycles not accepting the relationship. Oh, what do you have to say about that? Well, they would know about that, you know. But they, that's someone else's experience, is it? That was, that was it? yeah. That was not our experience because yeah, uh, was, I think your family no. accepted me. Ah, your family yeah, were exactly. very nice to me. Ah, your mom, just, yeah. your brothers. Yeah, they were yeah. always inviting me to the house, so the they accepted me. Just, just the way brought up as well. And uh, I think my mom, you've met my mom and she accepted you. Of course, yeah. Yeah, we so were, that was not for us, yeah. but somebody said this, that people within their social cycle did not accept their relationship. I never found that. Yeah, then another one said, I think the same person said this, family and friends kept their distance and not talking to her. That's crazy. So I mean, I think what I tried to like, you know, I was telling her, can you please expand on this, what this meant? And she said yeah. that some of her friends would say, I don't know when to call you. 
I don't know if your partner is there. I don't know if, if it's, it's right for me yeah, to talk yeah, to you. Yeah, yeah. So that was her own explanation on that. Mm -hmm. Then the one I actually added to it, which I think is the cons that I experienced was being stared at. People shaking their heads as you walk by or entry a, a restaurant. I remember vividly most times that I'm working with or when you see people smiling and, and staring at me. I don't know if they are... Yeah, I don't know, I don't understand, but I find it kind of embarrassing that people staring at me, smiling, Wait, so I'm you nodding their head. Absorbed. You didn't observe it because no. you were looking straight to where you were going. Yeah. As a lady, I was trying to observe my environment and I found people staring at me, right. staring at us, not only me anyway, staring at us. Some were smiling, mm. some were nodding their head. They smile at us when we are going to a restaurant. I, I keep telling yeah. you that. Remember yeah. when we were going to Debinance? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh -huh. yeah. So I experienced that. So that for me was not a good one. They should see us like normal people passing, not looking at these couples and like smiling. I don't know. Then the fourth one again, someone said was your family or friend asks you not to bring your partner over. That's crazy. Oh my God. That's oh, crazy. I can imagine what this guy is That's facing. That's experience. Yeah, thank God I didn't That's experience ridiculous. this. Yeah. I think uh, with what she was saying is that the family of the guy did not like a black girl. That's crazy. Right? So, and the guy loves her, yeah. uh, which is what is most which important is for me. Most important, yeah. Exactly. exactly yeah. And uh, she said, um, if there's anything, maybe, you know, in Ireland here, yeah, there's kind of this uh, Christmas... Christmas yeah, family Christmas, party, Christmas dinner, yeah. Christmas dinner. So mm. he was trying to bring the partner, and they said no, that Why? he can't invite her over. That's madness. So that's not a good experience. But for me, they are getting on well because the guy loves her, and she loves the guy. Well, that's, that's what matters. matters. So for me, I keep telling her yeah. that's what matters. Like it's a good thing. Exactly, and they are not even living with the family, so Just chop it down. Exactly, maybe with time they will get to uh, uh, to accept it. <laughs> what you cannot change, you take it. Yeah, it doesn't matter. So the fifth one I have to say is your partner. This one is kind of weird. Also, someone said your partner may feel uncomfortable when he or she is telling their family or friends about the interracial. Dating. No. This that this, sounds like someone who's not sure of themselves, you know. I think maybe the guy is not ready. Like I told her, like why is he hiding you? Like why can't he yeah, say to the public? Very insecure, you know what I, mean? I think the guy is insecure. Yeah, yeah. Very yeah. insecure so she will be thinking about that. Yeah, because I told her, um, I see this as a breaking point. I just told her the truth that if she's not careful, this is really a breaking point for their relationship because the guy is, the guy is like. That should not come into your head, let's say. No, the guy was like, I can't tell people about you. I can't tell people I'm dating a black he girl. It. He said oh, it. yeah. What? He said it to her. I was Asta. like, I was, I was telling her. Next one. I was telling her, like, uh, you have to really think. You have to really tell well, this guy. She to move on there, it's, uh... Yeah, she should move on. I told her that this is a breaking point. Mm -hmm. And uh, for me, I think that's a big con. It's like, it's, 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 not, it's, not, it's not a good one. Um. Thank you for watching our video. Yeah, so we just brought this uh, few ups and down mm. in um, interracial yeah. in interracial dating. Mm. So if you have, um, if you, you can leave in the description, yeah, any experiences in the comment guys. section, yeah, uh, what you think, and uh, if there's any other thing you can add to it. But for me, this is really a big. Yeah. It's really a big issue, but if you can overcome this, I think we'll overcome most of them. What do you think? We've passed the stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are no longer. We no longer see this as an issue. We never did see things that the did those things as an issue. I, actually, I complained of the steering. That was one. That was one. But later, I think I, I, I think I started enjoying the steering. When they are staring at me, I, I keep talking. I'm like, oh yeah, keep looking. Yeah. And with a cute man, I don't mind. Keep staring. So you see, yeah. thank you so much. Thank you. And don't forget to like, hit, share, and subscribe. We'll, be, we'll try and bring more videos. I think we have a good surprise. Yeah. More travel vlogs like we'll be coming. That's right, yeah. We are excited about that. Yeah. Thank God. And um, more videos. More, 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 more. Love you guys.
Thank you so much for staying with us. Thank you. And thank God we are growing. Thank you for thank you for being part of our family. We love you. Keep following us. Keep supporting us. And keep commenting. You can leave more questions for us. You can tell us more. Give us more idea. And thanks for watching our video. Yeah, thanks. Don't forget to hit like, share, subscribe, and we'll be bringing more videos to you. So you guys. If there's any other thing you want us to do, you can also leave in the comment section.